Good morning, parents and students. Um, I apologize if you can um, hear any like hammering and things in the background. Uh, they're doing work on my apartment building today. Um, so I apologize in advance if you find that disruptive or distracting in any way. Now, this video is going to focus on how to submit an assignment in Canvas. So uh, what you're going to do is the, if you um, ever need to re-reference this video again, you will see under announcements and important information, how do I submit an assignment? Find out here, and that is where this video um, will be located. All right, so let's scroll down and let's find an assignment that we've completed. So if we go down, let's do this one. So analyzing author's claim assignment. So let's say we've completed this assignment. Uh, we're going to go in. So it might take a second for me to load um, as I am recording. So during this time, I'm just going to take a sip of our coffee and wait patiently. Um, so once you get to this page, um, you are going to see that there are a couple of links for you and you're going to be using those links to complete your one is the PowerPoint version. Now a PowerPoint version is um, if you are working on a computer, if you're on a phone or a tablet of any other kind. Um, so if you are doing, and I will do a quick little lesson about how to, um, and then if you are working on a tablet or if you are working on a phone, you're going to want to work with the Google Slides version. So the first thing you're going to do is download it. Only if you are working on a laptop, because otherwise this is not going to work for you. If you um, are working on a phone or a skip minutes to that part of the video. Once you have downloaded it, it's going to appear in the lower left hand corner of your screen. And once it's completely loaded, you're going to want to click on it. And it's going to take a second for it to load, so just be patient. Don't click on it multiple times. Okay. So here it comes, PowerPoint. Again, give it a second. Be patient. Okay, so once this assignment is completely loaded and um, you follow the directions and complete it, um, you'll want to make sure that it is saved. Okay, so sometimes you'll have to click Enable Editing for you to complete an assignment. Um, so that way it will let you type on it. So then once you have, you know, you do, 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 you've completed your assignment, you're going to want to go to file. Save as. And then you're going to want to save it in a place that you can find it again. So I'm going to save it in my documents. Um, and I'm just going to uh, make a new folder. If you've never made a new folder before, you can you just right click and then you click new. And it should pull up a new folder for you. For some reason, mine isn't working right now, but that's okay. Um, I think it's probably because I'm recording. 
All right, now that you have your folder made, you're going to make sure you title yours and click Save. And once that is saved, it might take a second. So again, just be patient with your device. So once it's saved, you can X out of this and move on to go back to the uh, Canvas page. So now that we have it and we are ready to submit our You will click Choose File. Make sure it is under the File Upload tab. And then um, what you're going to get is a window for you to choose the file you created. So make sure that you choose. And, and then once you have chosen that file, so here's your window. Um, so once you've chosen that file, then you will be able to hit that Submit Assignment button. So I'm going to go to my file, Miss Stone Test Assignment, Open. And you want to make sure that it's completely loaded up before you hit that Submit Assignment button. Um, if you don't hit the blue button, it does not submit the assignment, and then I can't see it, and I cannot grade it, okay? Um, so that, that, that is the tutorial for, um, <clears throat> excuse me, um, for submitting an assignment. So uh, for the PowerPoint version, so now what I'm going to go into is... Um, completing the a Google Slides version or a Google Doc version of an assignment. So this is for people who are <coughs> completing uh, their work on a phone or on a laptop of some kind. Okay, so the first thing you're going to do is click here. It's going to take you to a page, um, the assignment, and for you to make a copy of that particular assignment. So what you're going to do is you're going to click make a copy because you want to have your own personal copy of this. That way you can edit it, you can add pictures, you can do whatever you need to do to make your work happen. Okay, um, so it might take a second because it is generating an entirely new document. Uh, so give it a moment to um, create the assignment. Okay, so your assignment um, loaded up in Google Slides or Google Docs, depending on um, what you're using. So you can see, you know, you, you've finished your assignment. Um, you're so excited to share it with me. So what you will do at this point, you're going to click in the upper right hand corner where it says share. You'll see where it says private only to me. Well, we don't want it to be private because um, otherwise, I can't see it, right? Um, so what you're going to do is you're going to click on that button, and then it's going to come up with a little loading screen. And once it leaves, you're going to see where it says share with others. Now, you don't want to type in my name because then it'll just send me to an email. Uh, you want to be able to submit it on Canvas. So you'll click Get Shareable Link. And this way, it's going to generate a link for you to share with me. Um, and then you'll be able to copy and paste that link into Canvas, and I'll show you how to do that in a moment. So um, it's generating the link right now. You can see where it says saving, whole new link. So it says link copy to clipboard, link sharing is on. So now you can share this link with me, and then I can immediately click on the link, and it will take me directly to your assignment. So then the next thing that we're going to do is we're going to go back to Canvas. So hold on. Okay, so now that we've completed our assignment and we've got our uh, link, we're going to click Submit Assignment. And you'll see an option where it says Website URL. So then you're going to copy and paste that assignment um, link in there. And you can put any comments if you have any questions or anything. And then you will hit that Submit Assignment button. If you do not hit Submit Assignment, I will not be able to see the assignment. And therefore, I cannot grade it. 
and uh, then I can't give you any feedback to help you improve. So um, I hope this answers all of your questions, and um, if you have any more, please either email me or contact me via Remind or Class Dojo or the phone number that I have posted on Canvas. Um, thank you so much, and I hope that you have a great day. Bye.